I'm slow to the party. I didn't even know what hey, you were I, I know. I stuck it in. You know what I'm saying? I know. You did not to be fucked on the blood. Y'all the man. You, 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 you did saying. what, sir? I, I, hey, pause. Thank you. That's all hey, I need. You know, hey, you know I'm old, man. I'll be doing all that mango shit. Nah, I understand. <laughs> and it sounded oh, super shit. spicy. So you know, my ears went up and I had to protect my neck. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just doing, you know. I no, nah, I hear you. I get it now. I had clarity is key. I get it. All right. But you know, I just had to let niggas know now that I ain't flying out. <laughs> no, I can't apologize. I'll be on my Bronx bullshit. I'm, you do niggas be on the extra shit when I'm on. Yeah. So so mm-hmm. niggas is wild childish. What it do, man? Mm-hmm. What's up? Sad, what's sad, all man. right. Yo, we got company. We locked in. We yeah, got yeah. company. I love So let's do this properly. First of all, this is your boy Cat Johns, uh, part owner of Dead Series Radio, Dead Series Entertainment, and also part owner of Cash Ribs on Wheels. Just want to put that out. Cash there. Ribs uh, on the West by far. Yeah. So y'all make sure y'all check that out. Oh, definitely, most definitely. Come tap in with your boy, man. How they tap in with you, bro? 702 609 2250. Come on, get lost in the sauce. Say it again, boom. 702 609 2250. Come on, and get lost in the sauce with your boy. Lost. I'm saying? Come on, and get lost in the sauce with your boy. So, you know, <laughs> no, definitely not introduce yourself, man. And, yeah, we got company. We, know, got, we got company. Food. We got, we got, we got, we got, we got, right. Please introduce yourself. Hey man, what's happening, man? I go by the name of Looney Wild, man. Y'all can find me everywhere. L U N N I E W Y L D. Saint Louis, man. You know we do have remedial yeah. people in the world. Unfortunately, <laughs> they're intellectually slow. Yeah, all right. So, so just break it down one more time. Bro. Wow, you feel me? That's L U two N's two I's two E's W Y L D. That's all everywhere, right. man. Go All right, all right, all right. Check and uh. Out. Sir, who's over here on the on the far uh, end over here? I ain't nobody special. It's Jay Gatsby, the great one, number four, and none come. All right. Everybody welcome back special. to Dead Serious. Welcome to, or well, welcome back. If it's your first time, welcome to. Right. Um, Blast. We got a special guest, and I I don't even want to say special guest because a certain podcast, a radio station say that. That's not us. We got some company in the house, and he's famous. All the top, like. If you, if you connected with Dead Serious, you Dead Serious. So we're going to let him talk to himself. I'm excited about this because when I tell you talented, <laughs> listen, bro, no, you, talent. we're going to get into his music in a bit. You don't have to take my word, but y'all going to prove the scene. I'm telling the truth. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Now, and if y'all rocking with Dead Serious and you know Jay Gatsby, the great one, you know I call it like I see it. And most times I see it the other way. But not today. Oh, we'll get into that. <laughs> all right, all right. Blasts. Turn me out, then. Uh-huh. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Look, here, let's see. Let's play this first song. Listen, yeah. You tell us what do you? You got the floor. You're a guest, and just yeah. like with guests, you make sure that they house is your house. Okay. okay what can okay. we start the people up with? This is you. How you want to present yourself? Um, let's start that. Uh, I got this shit on, man. Let's play that. You feel me? Oh, yeah, y'all make sure y'all go get y'all merch, man. The Wolf Sluice is in, man. We on the love family. Y'all make sure y'all go get the merch, man. WolfGirlSTL.com. www.wolfgirlstl.com. All right, y'all heard the man. Y'all heard the man. So, we're going to pause for a little bit. And we. Play this song, right? Yes, sir. I got that Give shit on. Quick second. I, know, I, I told you with truth. That shit. <laughs> fresh as a daisy. What's wrong with y'all, man? Your son, son is the part. I'm telling man, y'all, it's man. not just the music. He's really who he say he is. Bob yeah, right. introduced everything before a person speak, right? Exactly. That's what I was taught, and yeah. that's what I seen in my time. He the boy. Yeah, all right. And he got that shit on. Yeah, all right. Let me turn y'all up real quick. Man. Yeah. Turn this up loud as y'all can. All right, let's uh, see. Don't disturb the peace, but <laughs> no, disturb the peace, please. I do it all the time. Quick, man. 
I don't want to tell nobody to commit crimes and then they in a society like this they blame me. It's not a <laughs> <laughs> it is like that. <laughs> tell a nigga to be peace. Jay Gatsby told me to do it. It is not a crime. Yeah, with that system you got in that truck, how yeah you do well, I say <laughs> you know, right, to <laughs> All of a sudden, I don't let them hear. Straight up. I have spare just in case. <laughs> Straight up. Amp it up a notch. Man, you feel me? What's up? What's up? Oh, yeah, man. It's a pleasure, brother. It's a pleasure having you, man. I appreciate y'all, man. You got it. Y'all right. Y'all right. I'm trying to turn up in this big So, for starters, since you are new to our audience, right, mm -hmm. and we still chopping it up, uh, we gonna ask me where you from first. Of all. Yeah, I'm from St. Louis. He knows Missouri, man. He's from the Louis. Six. For those that never been to St. Louis, mm -hmm. just do your research. Yeah. I don't. My it experiences might not be with it. everybody. <laughs> it hit different. It different. It hit. Listen, my old G's had me there. I'm not gonna date myself, but when I was roughly like in my early 20s, I frequented a lot. And I'm out of town. I'm from New York. I'm from the Bronx. Shut up. And my OGs from the Bronx is like, listen, you get around. Don't be around some main men when you get to the loo that knock your head off. <laughs> now, you know, I'm from the X, and I respect gangsters everywhere. I yeah, wipe right. my feet off when I step in anybody's house. I was around main men out there. They took me around. I had a great time. And because you're from the loo, I got to ask you a question you may know about. The What's that? They took me to a club. I'm having a great time. And a record drop, right? Mm -hmm. I don't believe it was a hip hop to my recollection. It was kind of like a dance record. Mm -hmm. But all I can say is when the DJ dropped it, I heard the people over the loudspeakers. They went crazy. <laughs> so it was a dance record? I had to run up to the DJ, ran up, let him do his thing. When he had a minute, I said, yo, what just set the world on fire, bro? Like, what was that? Yeah, he says it's a St. Louis classic called Whirlwind. Whirlwind, yeah, you familiar with that? Uh, uh, it might be for the old niggas like me. You see, the crazy. <laughs> I don't yeah. color nothing, so I, mean, I gotta I hear it. I, I, I didn't hear so much music. Man. I I that, that's the thing. thing. I, I didn't, I didn't grow, I didn't grow up in like a uh, uh, household. See, yeah, and that's so what I'm saying. You done seen everything that came shit. out of the year. Yeah, we didn't dance to a lot of shit. We didn't dance to a lot of shit. But I can tell you what it was on it. Damn right. And if y'all never been to the Lou, I'm talking to the men. Look at me. The Lou got some of the baddest black women walking this planet. Period. Period. They got uh -huh. some joints out there. <laughs> and I saw some joints going crazy to this song. And I'm like, y'all watch that. Uh, yeah. They show me world. Sure. He said it's the same world. It's kind of classic. I guess to probably our older generation, because it was an older song. It wasn't rap. That mm -hmm. was a mighty long time ago. So now nah, listen, the Lou. I mean, I don't have to run through the resume of what the Lewis produced. Mm -hmm. the mainstream, of course, you start with Nelly. I still well, got to say Chingy. Listen, yeah, yeah. he was a major artist on a major yeah. label with a room shaking record. Yeah. So no matter what people think, you got to put him in there. You got to get that. And battle rap is now pop culture. Shout out to Verb, Verb, Vegan Verb. What up? Hitman, what up? Shout out. <laughs> listen, yeah, yeah, yeah. I see them at all the URL events I frequent yeah, in the right. past. I used to be a black star in Harlem when it wasn't the URL, when it was Smack DVD. Yeah, and they was right. out there deep Damn from right. St. Louis, not scared of nothing. Damn right. I asked Damn my man, he said, it's ball game. No, listen, when they come out, they mob. They come in, they fly, yeah, they fly in, they fly in together. Yeah, we outside. <laughs> and Verb used to, hit me, that Verb used to tell me, no, nah, we don't really fly when Smack want to put us on a plane. We got to take the car. We can't get on a plane with those right. things. Yeah, now. Right. Long story yeah, short, the loot is the loot, man. Let's show for sure, for sure. You can't just walk around if it's not if you're not with the right people. And if you could do that, I don't think that's a good idea. To look <clears> on the <throat> I don't think it's good. Beautiful city though. It's yeah, not a cool. violent city as a whole. But hood is hood. Yeah. It's just that's not a hood you want to play around. With. Let me say that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm right. And yeah, I will right. say your music reflects <laughs> my experiences in the trenches there. Yeah, I'm, I'm right. not no gangster nigga, but I was around gangster niggas. Yeah, you know right. what I'm saying? Nah, I'm real sure. And I knew where I was at all times, and when I heard your music, yeah, he done been through. Yeah, right. Can't fake that. Yeah, right. Yeah, right. When we get into his music, y'all will see it, and y'all agree. Yeah, right. Y'all got to turn it up, man. Y'all see it, man. 
Yeah. This shit, this shit speaks for itself. And they're gonna see my, yeah, they're gonna see my. Yeah, right, they're, they're I'm gonna, gonna, see gonna come. Hey man, 2024 is an angel year, yeah, man. Yeah, I don't even know what's going on. Hey, everybody yeah, got the Bruce Lee work on so far this year. I'm gonna fuck them up. Hey man, I'm gonna fuck them up, man. Let's go. I'm gonna fuck them up. So, so what made you come to Vegas? Yeah, because we are streaming live from Vegas, everybody. Yeah, if you don't yeah, know, for the right, first yeah. time, we out here in Las Vegas. <clears throat> Super Bowl week, just as a reference. Yes, sir. Yeah, yeah, San yeah. Francisco and the Chiefs will be getting it on down the block on yeah. Sunday. Can't wait for the big game. Boy, it's not too stupid. Yeah, man. I, I, <clears throat> yes, bro. Spirit, spirit guy that said the Chiefs is trying to take it. You feel me? Uh -oh. I ain't going to lie. You feel me? Man? Yo, I got to tell people go... this, too. And a lot of people that don't live in Vegas is sleeping on one factor of this game. What's that? These are clearly the two best teams, right? We, this is going to be a home game for San Francisco. Yeah. There's so many uh, California yeah. transplants that are from the Bay that are Niner heads. This yeah, is right. Raider and Niner country. Yeah, right. So what? it's going to be a little much louder for them but than it will be. I don't I don't you know, know how much that's going to affect we'll, we'll look at the underdogs, though. Like, yeah, and that's the thing. There's so many other it. factors. I'm not even ready to pick the game. Me neither. But serious sure, sports, we're going to do that on Friday. Research. But, but I, ain't, I, ain't, I ain't going to lie to you. Watch what I say. Y'all can watch that game. And be like, that nigga Looney said. <laughs> that's <laughs> real, man. The spirit be talking to you. I kind of. I'm getting to the point where it's like, now, Patrick Mahomes, we all know he's the best quarterback in football. And. There's no situation he hasn't been in yet, and Purdy's the first two. Yeah, we can listen. You <laughs> better call ESPN. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, yeah. We're not going to do that. This is not about you. Let's we got to get into man. that. I got that shit on. Man, you're there yeah. right now, y'all now from the tune in to I got that shit on by Mooney Wild, man. It's dead serious in the same place. You did. Appreciate everybody that's tuning in, man. Cuffs up. We eat up. Cool. <laughs> yeah. You need. Yeah. It's time to turn up. The eyes know when they say they always do it. Okay, okay. certain age like myself who are possibly a little younger you'll remind it'll remind you of an artist that gave me this story yeah. if you're young you could go do your googles and you'll see Listen. what i'm saying <laughs> yo that is high energy and 
tempo and all that. Like, he was on some mystical shit. Yeah, yeah. right. Yeah. And yeah. Man, man, was that. That. At the time that. when mystical and, was with no limit. And nigga, I'm a fan of mystical. That was my favorite. That was my favorite. I don't give a fuck what that nigga did, bro. It's the same thing with Arkansas. I don't give a fuck what that nigga did. That nigga did the same shit with me, bro. Yeah, I'm just saying. Hey, but nigga, that's high energy. Yeah, that's high energy. I mean, that's high energy. I ain't gonna lie. Really, with that one, you said a video for that. That's gonna be crazy. Yeah, I recorded that song on my birthday. So you know, I was T. Though I had the Bel Air, I popped Perkin that bit. Everything that I did in the school, I put it on that on the track. You could tell. Freestyle the whole damn thing. That'll shake a spot too. That's gonna shake his spot. Bro, that motherfucker. What? I'm trying to tell you. It's like every soon as the beat come on, you gotta but like you gotta turn the fuck up. Yeah. Then that's a summertime joint. I'm gonna talk like you. Like, 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 I'm trying to put a midget in a, in a, in a, oh in a God. I'm trying to, I'm trying to, I'm trying to make it go by, right? Like, hey, so, man, man, what was, what, what, <laughs> it's not going on, you go ahead and read over. We're going to start from the beginning. Yeah. What influence did you get off the porch of rap? Was it another rapper growing up here? Was it local? Was it somebody in your life? Or was it another artist that was mainstream? Uh, what influenced me? Wayne, I can say Wayne had an influence on a lot of um, uh, artists uh, starting. Right. You feel me? But after I start tapping into music more, you feel me? I had to find my own way. You know what I'm saying? And then, mm-hmm. then, then, then music became a more of a uh, a coping, a coping. You feel me? Like you coping with. You say exactly you, say you found your own way, and I kind of can agree from what I've heard so far. Mm-hmm. Um, you don't just rap though. I turn it. This is what I'm saying. Yeah. The people need to know this. You you could blow a little bit, pause. You can sing. Pause. <laughs> pause. That's what you did. I caught myself. That was spicy. That was spicy. I'm just saying. I, the correction made, pause was made. Both sides, he caught the pause. Yeah, that, the <laughs> the yeah, yeah. terminology is crazy. Listen, so you gotta like, understand it. Like, you can't like, say shit. They got it. Like, they. But you got, but you understand the, the New York slang though. But but for motherfucker be hip to it, it's like yeah, like well, you know, false. Right. Yeah, true. <laughs> but not really. But nah, like yeah, that came you, from West Coast. You too. sing too. Yeah, that's right. Like you a whole vibe on on the music too. Like yeah, you're not it, King. not just a rapper. You got a story through your raps. Right. But you're an artist, yeah. in my opinion. Yeah, which is a big difference because I know rappers that's trash, mm-hmm. yeah. but they just happen to rap. But yeah. you really make good music. Mm-hmm. And what are some of the singers that actually let you know that you could really mix the two and kind of take it somewhere else and make it your own? I didn't know. I didn't. I'm gonna give it a buck. I learned. I learned to play with the melody. I learned to play with the vocals on the song that I was just trying out to stretch my vocals. I was drunk. It was the the single "Toxic." It gained like thirty thousand views on YouTube in like two weeks. And, and, and that was just me trying something new, like getting out the rapper stage. You feel me? The, the trenches and shit. That you had something. It was, it was yeah. But truth be told, I straight, I straight don't like that song. But I have to, I have to, I have to realize that that song is what gave me my sound. You feel me? And it's interesting that, that the it, best songs that people go crazy for like, is always the artists that really don't feel. Yeah. And you, and you're not the first person to say that. And what's crazy is. And I, cause sometimes it, I come around when I play it when I'm playing all my music, be like this motherfucker is actually a banger. And then it be day long, man, I fucking hate this song. Like, <laughs> like for real, you're, bro. you're bro, seasoned. Bro. I can tell that you're not just some dude that just started rapping. And right, you really right. put effort into it. Yeah. I, how I, long I, you been really? How long has it been since you jumped on the porch? I'm doing yes. music. So uh, we can go back to when I was seven. I got a picture right now on my YouTube. If y'all go on my YouTube page, y'all gonna see me a seven year old boy rapping in front of his old folks. You know what I'm saying? With birds. So I've been, I knew I had a passion for when I was seven. I began writing at the age of 12. I began uh, learning how to record myself at the age of 15. And I took it serious when I uh, hit Atlanta. 
after I moved from St. Louis, I went to Atlanta, uh, back to St. Louis, to Louisiana, Baton Rouge, back to St. Louis. Oh, he's moving around. Yeah. He's been traveling around. Yeah. Grabbing yeah. shit. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Speaking yeah. of moving around, I admire your hustle. You fresh off a flight, right? Yeah, damn right. When he man. just fresh came here flight. to us, hopping off a flight. Yeah, right. Just the whole, since he was presented to me yesterday, well, not yesterday, the day before yesterday, mm -hmm. I had just touched down back in Vegas. And as Sirius Sean does all the time, mm -hmm. Jay. Got somebody for you. All right, I'm gonna listen to that. <laughs> Tell him I stopped him in the middle of it because you know I'm listening, but I'm multitasking. Right. Then I said, "Hold on, wait a minute. Sun is fire. <laughs> Hold on, run that back. Let me right. let me really pay attention now. You remember the song that uh, he played for you? I don't remember the remember title. The you was talking. You was mixing melodies with rap. I do know that. Was it off the mixtape? Better man. Better man. Yeah, it was hard though. It was, <laughs> was, was talking to talk. Better man. Yeah, yeah, so talking to talk. That's it. That's the hook. Yeah. Yeah. He's about to bring you rap on the station. Just so so crazy. Yeah, you in the rotation. I let it rock out. I'm in the rotation. And you're just saying some more. I got you. I used to say, I guess. Now, listen, everything you sent us, whatever you got. Send it to us. It's going on the playlist. I got you. And for I the fans you. out there that make music, make sure it's good. Properly recorded, mix mastered, title properly, wrap mm -hmm. right up on who you are. I don't know you. Yeah. And um, MP3 format. Yeah. And, and um, we pay royalties. We pay motherfucking royalties, bitch. Yes, meaning, Lord. Meaning we're a licensed radio station, not right. niggas that put playlists together on YouTube and just play your shit. If we play you, we pay you. It's yeah, really right. that simple. Yeah, right. So tap in. We in Google Play, Apple Music. Yeah. Y'all niggas still got Blackberries and all that sexy shit. <laughs> Y'all got an app store. We in there. Damn so, right. And That's it's free fact. 99. It's no excuse. Go to deadserious.com. Dead serious spell S E R I U S. Yeah, Unfortunately, right. I gotta be remedial because it's niggas that'll say you spelled it wrong. No, I told you how it was spelled. It's not the traditional spelling. Sorry for that rant, but we gotta get this clear. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This clarity is key, and I'm tired of sending people the direct spelling yeah. or the direct link, and they're saying, and it's unique. "Can I get this mm -hmm. on Android?" I just sent you the Android link. Right. Yeah. It's yeah. not opening and, up. Then and, something's and, wrong with your phone because you know. I speak on some reading is very fun and fucking. Oh my god, that's a public <laughs> service. Oh my god, because oh oh I, I didn't have. To, I mean, what's crazy is I didn't oh have to ask god. if y'all had an app because. When I, I, that's why I chose him. When you send me that, when you send me that flyer, I, I did my own dig. I'm like, nah, I want, I want something. I love that I can promote them more. So yeah, I went to know. that, I went to that, 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 uh, that, 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 uh, that file that got the uh, Google ad, the, the yeah, actually yeah, the apps yeah. that's at the bottom of it. Yeah. So yeah. when I pull my face on, I'm like, oh, they, oh yeah, let's, let's go to the next one. Yeah, this yeah, is, go to this is music industry 101 for See, the artists. organized, and I. Not to cut you off, man, but man, I like I said, man, I'm more of a, I, 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 I don't know, bro. Like I, 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 I see yeah. a lot of shit, man. Like I, I see a lot. My perspective is of seeing things be way beyond what a person may think. What, what may people may think that's really just simple, but really, like I could have, I could have used the picture that was sent first, but I felt like. Why not? I know it's another. I know it's another picture out here that bring way more attention to the eye seekers. You hear me? And then on top of that, where can they find them? Instead of just having the name in the back, man, they just let you. I know, bitches. We got an app. You can go on the app store and download and listen to us live. Yes, man. Yes, so why sir. not put? Yeah, why not put the face on them? Artists. That's them. called initiative. Yes. Yeah, if I have to break it down smaller, it's yeah, called right. having the balls yeah, right. to do what you know is better yeah, and right. not have to ask questions. And not just for you need it. It's for you to all for everyone. everyone. Yeah. yeah. For everyone. You feel me? That's what I say, brother. Greedy would never eat for long. That's why I say, bro, I want to see everybody shine. That's bro. a gym. Say that mm -hmm. one more time. Please. Yeah, the greedy will never eat for long. Man. I want to see everybody one. Wow. Straight up. If if you keep that mentality, oh, you you're you're going where you're headed now anyway. You know what I'm saying? And you're I'm getting good. there because of that. Because you'd be surprised when you when you work in this business for so long and people know 
but you have any sort of notoriety or influence, yeah. they send you shit and they present their worst foot forward. Trust me, I didn't ask. Wouldn't you want to be remembered if you're sending exactly. something to somebody that you believe exactly. can help you along the way? Exactly. You'd be surprised, though. Exactly. What's crazy is, like, I, I didn't hit that, probably hit that level, but four years ago where people just felt like that, I was just so, I was different. I love you, different. I well, like I to see people before they open their face. Yeah, right. So yeah, but I used to, a lot of people used to want to work with me here, and I love used to work with a lot of individuals until I start recognizing my art here and how much dedication and how I break everything down for me recording. I could record the ad libs first throughout the whole song and then come in with the with with a with a hook and with the verse, and I probably start on the outro. Uh, first and probably do an intro and then probably do a verse and then come in with a hook. Like my whole work ethic is crazy. So me just hearing the beat, I can hear the beat, but I'm going to hum through the whole beat to get the cadence. Mm -hmm. And then I could probably say something like a 16 at the end of the whole song and then probably just re-record and say some other things different that I said it like bro my so you is crazy. The whole track i dissect really, everything you tap into I, it and make it i dissect the, I, I dissect the snare the drum the hi-hat the bass everything guitar piano i i i, I put everything in their own individual format mm, okay what pocket can i catch that mm -hmm. nobody else could catch wow you know what i'm saying yeah. so yeah that's it's called being a massive crap that's yeah. what it's called yeah. 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 if y'all don't understand that then Man, y'all not doing what y'all supposed to be doing. It's a digging, man. Yeah. And then yeah. being a person that also yeah. records too, man. Being a, being an artist and an engineer, that's like you gotta know you that gotta it's, know what you're doing. Man, like that. exactly, exactly. Especially it's difficult recording yourself, exactly, because you know how you want you to sound, exactly. and that makes you more perfectionist. Exactly, it's never gonna be perfect for you. Exactly. It's perfect. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? Exactly. Even no matter how many times you didn't listen, I probably got one song that I fuck around and mix like three times, and I got it mixed three because that's probably the best way that I like. But every wow. single one of them is a good mix. But to my ears, it's so sensitive to the point where now I strive for, I strive for what the, can the people hear this word? Can they actually hear this? Because I know I got a little accent, so it'd be like, I want can this person hear this? This bar, this metaphor. That's why I probably. Or cut the beat out or drop the beat mm -hmm. give it a low down tone so you can hear that metaphor that i just said you know man get you to think about it. man i dissect everything and i i'm not man it's just it's just, it's yeah. just and and it's just just hearing you say this i commend you on that shit. Man, i appreciate it was it was, it was, it was scary thing. for a while bro the real time man, but with motherfuckers they don't know i mean it it, it really was a, a a wave of mumble rappers like, no, it, it was, was motherfuckers wasn't really saying shit. And it goes back to when I was saying when I said fuck it, I was more I was trying to come out by doing industry music because mumble rap when Migos came out I was in Atlanta. And mm -hmm. I felt like oh you yeah, this was crazy. The, the yeah, impact was crazy. Really, so I got the you feel me, I couldn't never be like a mumble rapper, but I can I could I could dump down my my did. flow, but you yeah. gonna hear everything that I say. You right, right. So right. it's like but I got to the point I'm like, bro, this shit is done. I'm gonna just go ahead and just reverse. And you make niggas catch up. Yeah, yeah. And if the ones that got the train, yeah, yeah, it's gonna connect. Yeah. It's really simple. He's yeah. his authentic self. Yeah. And as a result, you attract the real ones. Damn right. And the fake ones, if they're interested in being a real one, they got to do their homework. Yeah, because I ain't gonna lie, I don't give a fuck who hate on Wayne. You would never hear them say that Wayne ain't the coldest punching king or Wayne ain't the because they're gonna have to give him their flowers. You ain't gotta listen to them. You we were talking about Wayne, was it yesterday? Yeah. Yo, and it was it was the one thing for me was like the fans of Wayne at that time, in my opinion, started jumping out to unrealistic st stats mm -hmm. and it made people hate them. Yeah. But it's like sometimes yeah. the artists get the, the flack for what the fanatics do. Yeah, and I think Wayne, you can't tell a story of hip hop without Little Wayne. No, 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 no matter what you feel about him, you may not. This music might not have connected with you, or it really, really did. But either way, you can't. That's easy. Like you can't. Like this is easy to be talking. I went to Louisiana. I went more to Louisiana and Baton Rouge in '09. So shit, I really got to see like you feel me how he was. Wayne, Wayne, run that. 
Damn, Damn right. Right. I've been listening to Wayne yeah, right. since like 96, 97. Right. <laughs> when he first came out with Big Time was on the when green, first came green, out, the yeah, green yeah. CD. I'm going to go back, nigga, how you love that. You know like, what I'm talking about? I'm that nigga been a right. nigga since then. I'm a man of a certain age. So I'm just when saying. Cash Money, he first popped out with Cash Money. Right, I'm like, okay, what is this little thing? Right, right, right. right. So <laughs> I thought right. he was talented. I thought he added a little nice old spin for a young nigga with a crew. Right. As he got older, and he went solo. Man, he took I'm not saying what did it for me. It was over. He took the fuck when out. I was it in was college, over. no ceilings. It was over. Yeah, no ceilings was this shit. And then the mixtape series with Gutter Gutter and them niggas, yeah, like, yeah, that's when yeah, he really, yeah. and for real, in, there, right? in New York, we really started fuck with him as a solo artist because of Joel's. Mm. He can't feel my face. Mm. So we was, Joel's was fisheries back then. Yeah. And so it was yeah. Wayne. So yeah. Wayne started really getting into that New York mode where we embraced him. Yeah, right. right. But then the no ceilings. Yeah, arguably no the best mixtape ever, along with Cushion Orange Juice and shit like that, like yeah. the staples. Nah, but no ceilings, way. I ain't gonna lie, like yeah, the no ceilings was the shit. Damn, he was a remix king, bro. Like he used to come up oh, with yeah. everybody else shit and demolish their ass. You feel me? And properly yeah. do it. Yeah, man. Respectfully, and disrespectfully, and can't, can't you can't do shit. Can't do shit. I I was was nigga, you can just say, "Damn, Wayne just this." Okay, that's like, oh. There was two niggas at that time that was able to do that and make people songs better Wayne than and him. him. And he was one of them. Fifty Cent was another. Oh yeah, Fifty Cent was definitely. But they, you know, know. Yeah. but that's all. But he had a machine. Man. Fifty Cent is yeah, yeah, he was, gonna have his. He gonna have his flowers for sure. But far as in like, we ain't talking many man. Fifty Cent. No, 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 no. We talking. Where you taking nigga songs, jacking it, no permission, and making you not want to hear the original no more. Exactly. That's, that's what it. Wayne was that's where, that's where it came to the point with me. See? So now I'm finna, I'm, finna, I'm finna break it down right now. I guarantee you everybody that heard that track start, right? She's a runner. She's a track. Yeah. I guarantee you any money, if we look, if we play my track star version right now, you hear me? You ain't going to want to hear it. You ain't going to want to hear the new. You ain't going to want to hear the new original. I wasn't supposed to make that remix, but somebody, a, a, a supporter hopped in my inbox and said, you should do a uh, remix to the track star. I already made my mind up. I said I wasn't going to do it. Why? Because there was so many people that was doing it. Mm-hmm. But I guarantee you, boy, should you not? Uh, it was just one day I, I finished the damn song and released it. And that motherfucker hit 14,000 views. And like, yeah, the I'm people right. talking what you're releasing. Yeah, they yeah, telling right. you what it is. Yeah, man. and then what's crazy is I love that shit. But like, knowing that, first of all, an independent artist, I don't think this shit is easy, bro, because this shit ain't easy. It's more work than having a label because you got to do yeah. everything by yourself. Exactly. But knowing that you actually have individuals that listen, and then not only they listen, but they give you suggestions, I love that shit. Because mm-hmm. I like, like, I'm going to be the artist where when God bless me with the wealth, you hear me? I'm going to be the artist that, that the other artist wasn't. You hear me? I'm be on live talking to my people, giving mm-hmm. people chances, and you feel me, giving them constructive criticism. You hear me? I'm gonna be that artist where I be like, man, which I think my next project should, you know what I'm saying, be called or whatever the case may be. Just again, you feel me, just to interact with them to let them know, bro, hey, bro, I'm not no better than you. I can I can help you get in the same position that I am in because I know how that shit feel when you feel me with it, you on the opposite side of the screen. So shit, bro, it's, they gonna get a different with Looney. So you said Wayne, Loop right? Yeah. So any influences musically from the loop? <clears throat> far as in, um Music, I mean, we came up on Nelly Chingy and shit like that. Uh, right. But far as in, um, I didn't have. Be, I can even have be an underground name. rapper. People that may not be familiar with the new community. Yeah, uh, I'm gonna give you the buck. Everybody was, everybody was trying to be on their own. They was trying to be on their own wave. You feel me? So everybody okay. was trying to break off from the Nelly and Chingy thing and make their own. break the stigma of saying yeah, Exactly. Like, That's why it's speed it. music now, you feel me? Because we didn't made our, our own way. You feel me? We didn't broke off from what Nelly and Chingy was doing and made our own way with high speed music. So it, it was different. And me, I just uh, I just wanted to be different. Something that, was, that was, You that have siblings or you only yeah. child? No, I got siblings. Okay, how I many? A lot of them. Okay, <laughs> so you, you come from a thick line of a family yeah like like my my uh my cousins and my cousins and my brothers facts you know what gotcha. I'm saying? Like, i come from a big family as well and i'm asking yeah, that because yeah. that shaped me you know, who i was i had cousins slightly younger slightly older so my age yeah, like real and shit like i mean it like, you coming from the loo i'm asking because that helped shape you and as people get to know your music more 
they'll connect the fact that right. you are from the loop. Yeah, right. You know what? What, what turned me up? You know what turned me up? I was all on the, you know, we on the West Coast, but you know, my, my roots is in St. Louis, the Midwest, right? What turned me up was when, goddamn me, my big brother called me, you heard me, the hood is nigga, you feel me? We be in the hood. Like, I'm talking about we, when I'm back in the city, we in the hood. That's what we in the hood. We go to the club, we, we got, you feel me? We, we be right. doing our thing. For him to call me, be like, hey, bro, what was, what was that song that you was, you was singing, you feel me? Woo woo, because you, you, you expecting for these niggas to be listening to you. ESCG, 42 Doug, them niggas, you feel me? You feel me? You know what I'm yeah, saying? So, well, for, for, for the hood to be, be behind me as well, like, hey, buddy, you gonna lie, you snapped on that motherfucker. Motherfuckers can feel that shit, like. And that like, keep like going, that. too, because y'all all got your back. That's a right. different type of thing. right, you hear me? It's like, and I was working towards, and that's what and that's what I, what I wanted that I work for, you feel me? Like, I want to, I want to, I want to get the, Get my family, get my, get my husband to know, like, shit, that's what I'm doing. I didn't hate rapping with it. You feel me? They support me. They most definitely support me, man. That shit, that shit means everything to me. I know it got to be tough, too, with, you know, just being an artist coming from a certain demographic and all that. Like, what do you mean? Tough? Have you experienced the hate that come with being a rapper, too? Because uh, yeah. it's the most, they say it's the most dangerous job in America. Yeah, no, they right. I don't witness a lot of hate. I don't look, I don't witness, I won't say, I wouldn't witness a lot of hate. But just the I nature say, of hate of people. Yeah, most definitely. I would, you, you know, you get them in the visions where you feel me. Um, you see it, you see it a lot. Nah, well, you see, you see it a lot in the, in the artist competitions, right? You feel me? If it ain't, you feel me? Yo, yo, people, you feel me? It's like, you feel me? Fly from Wu Wang. You feel me? So yeah, you they see don't want to give it up. You see it, but you ain't going to actually, I ain't actually heard nobody say, like, you feel me? Like, nigga, stop. It's, it's, you just get put it. Put it on the hook. You, you can't. You ain't got it. I ain't never heard nobody say that. Nothing you like feel that. Me? Yeah, yeah just never heard nobody say that. Quiet. Hey, I say like, hey, more so like, you know, we we got a radio thing popping. Nigga, like, yeah. There's niggas that don't support just because yeah. they don't want to see niggas wink. Yeah, they yeah. hate my face. Right. right. That's like shit. didn't do you nothing. Mean? Don't even but, know niggas' names type shit. But you know what's crazy is like, what, what's crazy is with us though. We like. Like our biggest ops, you feel me? Make music, we every distance and everything, you feel me? But shit, we get got it till we be, we'll fuck it right. Not, why ain't you gonna say that, you feel me? But yeah, we, we listen to that shit while we do Of course, it's constructive criticism to yeah, me. Yeah, nothing, you right? know what I said? I get it. Motherfucker, man, niggas like pot. <laughs> you staying in tune, you staying in tune with what's being said in the streets. Man, nah, that's not wrong with I you. Nothing, man. But I, I can tell you rise above more like, you got too much. And time invested in your your music and the yeah, presentation. I uh, this year I I've been bucking down. I said, man, fuck that. I'm like, everything everything that these labels are doing. I'm finna. I, I could do it my damn self because with promotion is the same thing that I say. We're gonna run these ads. We're gonna promote yeah. this shit. We're gonna yeah. put on playlists. We're gonna yeah. do that. But so, why we man, what they doing the yes, same sir. shit? Yes, sir. Yeah, man, we can yeah, build this shit. Do yes, they, we gonna put it in their face. Yeah. That's it. Hey, and when while doing it, and yeah, right. let them know. Yeah, this is the way. Now what? That faith, that faith, man. Hey, he's gonna get you there. He's gonna get you there. I'm pushing everybody. Everybody that's in my fucking circle, I'm pushing. It was just an Uber driving that when he came and got me from the airport. I'm like, he was telling me he did field directory and she's going okay. moving. He like, I ain't been doing it for two years. I said, yeah, nigga, it's time to get back on it. Right. <laughs> fuck you, stop, folk. Man. Yeah, man, we time to get back on it. I said, yeah, bro, give me your number. You gonna get a text from me and say, bro, I hope you get, I, I hope you get to work. What you got? I'm gonna hear it. What's that? Right. So, we, you know, so I'm pushing everybody. Bro, today, that's damn that's right, bro. I'm pushing. If you got, if you even thought about putting something in, 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 in that much, if giving something with so much power, you feel me? And you, and you say you just stop, bro. Like, you, you, you sleeping on yourself. And I'm that person where I'm finna, I'm finna pick you the fuck back up because I just slept on myself. I, you feel me? I had some people pick me up, goddamn me, then. I realized I had to pick myself back up, but if I feel like that, it was something that could potentially get you out of you feel me the hell hole that you was in, bro. Big Chris said, "Pick That's, yourself up." Yeah, yeah right, bro. Like, bro, we gotta push yeah, each other, nice. bro. We gotta push each other. I don't give a fuck. Yeah, it is. And that's yo, Hove got a line on on um the original reason we got. He said, "What? He said if everyone will be each other's crutches, we'll never fall." Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, if mm -hmm. everybody is everybody crutch, That's nobody can fall. That's it's right. impossible. It's impossible. But a lot of times, people want instant gratification. Yep. And want to just do yeah. things their way and fail. Yeah. Not yeah. realizing yeah. The, the old tale is true. You get further together than you do apart. Yeah. Yep. Yeah.
But they and see just it. meeting you as an artist before I knew who you was personally, just the way it was presented to me, your energy was collectivism. Yo, you got this, I got this, let me do that. You got that, let's put it together. That's how we get ahead. So for those that don't share that, you go do it by yourself and meet us at the top. Let us know the ground was. Exactly, the bottom too crowded. So how you loving the West Coast? You a transplant like everybody that live here. Nobody that lives in Vegas is from Vegas. No, just for I'm people not that's not from Vegas. I don't know. I, I ain't gonna lie. I, well, I knew why shit, but I can't talk about. It, but uh, it was, <laughs> yeah, we can. You know, we got personal. Uh, we, 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 um, yeah, the the journey of us moving. This, the way is, yeah, this moving. is where the part of the journey yeah, is. Yeah, the part of the time. journey. Okay. Yeah, you feel me? And then on top of that, um, I've been here. I've been, I've been back in about eight years. Okay. okay. Hey, feel me? I'm back in, off, off and on. Shit, back to the city and shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You feel me? I didn't have my first show, shows. You feel me? Networking. You feel me? Actually, you feel me? Like, you feel me? Like, hey, so. Some people gonna get mad with this next question. Mainly mm-hmm. people that rep here. Mm-hmm. What's your experience with the culture of Vegas hip hop? I'm gonna give you the buck. See, a lot of people didn't realize. <laughs> Hey, but see, that's what, a lot of people didn't realize that Vegas had culture. Like, you got to understand that it's the West Coast, Midwest, East Coast. You feel me? Nice. But you got to understand what the South. Yeah, in the South. You hear me? Yeah. You know, that's Midwest, East, South. You feel me? But you got to understand, like, anybody with, a, with an accent, with an accent, you hear me? You got to understand that it brings, it brings culture. It brings culture within them. You feel me? So everything will be different. Terminology, bro. That far, that far as the terminology, the way people speak, you hear I me? Mean? Like, just because we may not understand, they they understand what the fuck they talking about. Just the Haitians, goddamn it, Japan, Jamaica. like Jamaica. They don't, you feel me? Like that's their culture. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? But I ain't gonna lie, like Vegas had a, a, a crazy type of culture for me to actually realize that they have culture because it's like more of the West Coast. You feel me? Like. This is some shit that I was seeing when I was in St. Louis and you feel me watching Friday and shit. I didn't know you niggas was they Cali and Vegas are actually talking like that. You know what I'm saying? I'm yeah. thinking it was full scripted, but it's for real. Like, bro, like, like bro, like, it fucked me up. Like, yeah, I was good. Like, 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 that shit fucked me up. Like, so it was like, get the call. Yeah. Get the call. Yo, this nigga said, call on. This nigga said, the same shit, shit, bro. Two months ago, I was like, get the call. I was like, get the what? Get the call. I look at the call. Yeah, but now nah, you feel me? Like, you know what I'm saying? Vegas got, I, I, I like to adapt to that culture. Right. And you I know, like I'm, I'm thinking more of like the hip hop culture. Like, yeah, that's all I, was I, I I'll elaborate on my, my thoughts, right? Yeah, that was. We moved out here in 2016, right? Mm-hmm. And set up shop, radio, get to meet different people that's in radio, obviously, artists, right. producers, right. DJs. Vegas doesn't have a culture. Mm-hmm. I think they have an identity crisis. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, no, no, that's <laughs> that shit either. <laughs> I had it, in my, in my hey. certain amount of years of life on this earth, right? <laughs> Neo, R&B, 702, yeah. R&B, please tell me the rapper that is known mainstream after all, after 50 years of hip hop. Don't worry, years. I'll wait, they have none. <laughs> Listen, <laughs> I, I gotta give, I mean, I, 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 I ain't gonna lie, I gotta I give it to. I radio to bullshit Well, 50 y'all. years, yeah, well, yeah, it's you know what I'm saying, but busy, right, I mean, he, 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 he Now, we he know this, you know what I'm saying, busy, right, and, and work. Work, you feel me? But I mean, he's I a phenomenal lie. artist. I will give credit where credit is due. Yeah, but but the reality, we're gonna keep it a band. Fifty years. Nobody old, knows his heard. name in the same I'm ilk a, as someone that's on his level, talent wise, in other places. I'm gonna give you the band. So I'll say that. I'm gonna give you the band. I when I, I didn't. I thought I thought Vegas was more like the rap battle rap culture. You feel me? Because I was back at home seeing. Uh, uh, a hat I had and things like that. So that's all I seen. I didn't never really see no artists out here, you feel me, shooting videos and shit like that until I actually came out here and, uh, you know, network with a few artists that was out here. So I thought they was really just off the battle. We're, gonna, we're definitely going to pass your music on to 
one of our extended family members, Big Scoon. He's the oh, only yeah. bright spot in the Vegas community from a collective. Shut up. Oh, oh, yeah. Shut he's up. a DJ. Cool. He's a part of the Lost Elements. Appreciate one that. third of them. Um, they run the town. Scoon, you gotta come when you come through this town and you try to break in on the underground and beyond. Mm -hmm. Scoon, you have to touch Big Spoon when you touch the town because yeah. sh shout out to Scoon. Shout out to Body shout Radio. To That's the family. Okay. Um, if it wasn't for him opening my eyes to what Vegas had to offer, like the solid niggas like you, the artists that's out there making good music, but more importantly, out there promoting, shaking hands, getting yeah, to the right. flag, doing what you got to do. Yeah, right. When I say they don't have a culture, that's a minority here. Like, that's what stuck out about you to me. It's like, yo, he got his shit together? It's such a non-common occurrence. You mm -hmm. would think that more rappers would be. There's a lot yeah, of yeah. artists that are out here. Yeah, don't get it twisted. Sure. It's a lot of here. It's hella But they don't have their shit straight up. And sh salute to our man 12 a.m. too. He got it too. Yes, yeah, yeah, sir. Yeah. 12 a.m. Yeah, no, nah, real shit. Uh, what up, brother? Shout out, shout out. I, I can say that, bro. Like that's why that's why I say it is I'm different from the uh, rest of the artists. You mm -hmm. feel me? That's why I say that's where a little hate come in as well. Like they they, they may see that I got my shit organized, how I want my shit to be and they, they wanna got, be like you and they mad. You feel me? You, you know what I'm saying? Like on. you feel me? You know what I'm saying? So it's like you just get your shit together. Yeah, the good. rap game is free to hustle and <laughs> so separately. I promise yeah, you, man. All day. That's what You're it right, is. Right, man. Shit. Gotta take care of your business. But, yeah, man. But uh, to those individuals that I did touch bases with, you know what I'm saying? Keep doing your shit. Oh, yeah. Yeah, right. Keep doing your shit. Right. Oh, and it's a competition here, too, though. That's another thing, though. Oh, oh yeah. It's a competition at this moment, bro. Like, it's a competition. Like, everybody want to be a. Uh, the top star, but everybody got the same flow. You know what? Mm -hmm. You know what kills me about out here? Mm -hmm. Nobody's from here that lives here, right? Right. But when I when niggas present me their music, people back where they from don't know who they are. Right. That just tells That's me you're not working. Right. That's, right. 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 That's right. it. That tells right. me you just not on your job. Because right. even before person branch out, it all starts at home. Right. If a couple of niggas don't know you rap, you mm -hmm. do it as a hobby at that point. Right. And That's if your home base don't fuck with you, right? right. Right. You ain't doing something right. You can't, you can't spend, <laughs> just yeah, like man, for real. And that was the that was the main thing with me. Like, I never decided to move to another state and grab the uh, the supporters from that state. You feel me? I always wanted my support from my state. Yeah, first. you feel me first. Yeah. You did. So you gotta like, start at the crib. Yeah, you feel me? Because if, if you, you didn't, off, if you fuck off that part, then right, man, you, you might as well. You might want to just start, start up. Yeah, you feel well, me? Start new day. You know what I'm saying? Man, just start that shit, man. man. For sure, man. I was like, hey, you gotta be organized with this shit, man. You gotta know how you want this shit. You gotta put this shit together. How you supposed to put it together? You know what I'm saying? Like, so you, you, you got a lot of music too, um, mm -hmm. and a lot more than I probably even know right now because, again, I'm two days in and mm -hmm. I'm starting yeah, to catch right. up. Nah, so, future projects coming out now. Have something out now or something coming soon? Yeah. What's so, up? What's up with that? So I just dropped my uh I just dropped the mixtape last year, uh September twenty first. It just came up. Um now February seventh, I will be dropping uh I got two singles that will be dropping this month. I said fuck it and say I'm gonna drop them. I got uh February seventh, Minister Society, and then the day before Valentine's Day, February thirteenth, I got an industry song called M2D. You know what I'm saying? So now I that Minister Society. We got that loaded up. I don't know yeah, if you want to share that to people. Uh, yeah, we can give them a We can one. take a break and let them right. listen to yeah. it. Yeah, we can mute the mics on time. That shit. That's good. Right. Right. Okay. Right. Yeah, man. Here it, we go. Introduce it, man. Yeah, man. Yeah. <clears throat> now, with this Minister Society, I ain't going to lie. Like, it came, it came different. You feel me? Like I say, I'm alternative, so I can get on any type of swag, no matter what it is. You feel me? In a genre, I'm on it. Pop, rock, whatever. You feel Let's me? Let's go. Um, but yeah, I, I, this motherfucker most definitely a head bopper. You got a head. Yeah. All right. You feel me? Listen to it. Tap in. Minister Society will be out February 7th on all ESP platforms. Right. You dig? And I am on every platform. February 7th. This side. February 7th. Minister wow. Society. Here first. <laughs> 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 
My man is on the rise. And if y'all don't like seeing his face, too fuck it back and be pushing him over here. This yeah, right. He's going into the system. Yes, sir. He's going to be on radio every day. Yes, sir. We pay royalties. That's if y'all don't have the drive, the determination, and the, uh, the attention to details like this, young man, need not apply. I don't want to hear your MVP. Because nope. <laughs> it's more than just good music. This man's energy, he's respectful, he's attention oriented. Like he he kind of put me on the spot last night. I just heard about him. He called him. We tapped in. We chopped it up for a bit. He said, yo, send me something. I'm going to send it right back. Nah. He sent it right, right back. <laughs> no. Keep me on my toes, which is what I love about my team. Whatever I can't do or whatever I fall short, they pick me up. And you are what I preach to these artists to be. Serious about the crap. Yeah. Presentation is yeah. everything. Yeah. If he would have presented to me and the shit wasn't recorded where it had to be, you think I'm circling back asking him to play that shit again? I don't think he is. play <laughs> something else? Or oh, let me see is. the YouTube and all that? Yeah. He's showing me everything. He like, yo, he got music. Pandora, YouTube. Yeah. We was watching your video this morning. <laughs> he pulled up for the wakey-bakey exit. 
Yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> he like, nah. I'm on the tube. I'm like, all right, we doing this interview. Let me get prepared. Let me yeah. see eyes on the video so I can at least be informed about what I'm doing. Right. The video, he was I was already sold we was gonna lock in. The presentation for the video. Put some money into y'all shit, artists. I promise you. <laughs> he is on his job. Yeah. Presentation is everything. Yeah, right. Everything so far that he's presented, he's him. Let's go. Let's say that one more time. Say that presentation is, him to understand. Presentation yeah. is everything. It, is. it makes the difference between somebody telling you, what's your email? Let's lock in. Let's link. Let's have a video chat. Yeah. Or it's the other side of it. It could be running to me. Yeah. And it's not written up to me. And it's already yeah. fuck out of here before I can tell you the fuck out of here. Now listen. Yo, do you know we used to do, like I said, UPS is hiring when we're critiquing music. We're globally streamed, not just a local joke thing. 30, I'm not gonna embellish. 32 at 32. last count, and that yeah, was 32. some six months ago. I think countries. it might be like 38. Uh, yes, that was a humble brag, but the facts is not bragging to you. Yeah, we, right. You're being recorded on a weekly basis live in front of at the max 5,000 in a couple of times live on it's Football right. Sunday. It's Come on, we were doing yeah. something right. Multiple times. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. And we tell you, title your track, send it to MP3. We get some shit that says track one. Come on. <laughs> and then the subject line, fuck with us. Yeah. Who? <laughs> I don't got a title. <laughs> you didn't have a title. Fuck with who? Not you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Cast for the right, ghost right, ass right, nigga. Right, right. We're not doing that. <laughs> and I still get that to the nah, And I get it. I'm man. signing artists sometimes that know I'm tapped in yeah. and they want to get some more views or one more streams and you know get on some playlists or whatever. Shit, I'd be like, damn nigga, I got like, I title. know you said <laughs> <laughs> I know you sent it to me. Yeah, right, right. Like, right. Shoot, like, we put it in the radio system and it's on the app. You don't want your name attached to track one. Right. Because you know, not a humble brag, but you never know who listened to that series. We're connected people. Right. It's not the quantity, it's the quality right. of people that tap right. in with us. Right. And they respect what we present. And I'm never going to let one of these struggle rappers bring my name down. No, right. So no, they're right. not even making it to the system. So for you, I appreciate that. we had to do the discount double check for nothing. Because it was mm -hmm. there, but, yeah. Yeah. you know, yeah, right. it's important for me to stress that in this interview because you're getting to see... What a total artist look like. Good music. Appreciate it. Freshly recorded. Staying yeah. fresh to death. He throw that shit on. Right, he bro. said it. Like I ain't saying he on, said man. it. I agree. <laughs> we got to play that shit too, man. That's in the email. Man. I got that shit on, girl. Yeah. <laughs> Did you get that one? I never got it, brother. He, it might be in his spam folder because it was sent from his email. And if y'all don't got the same thing, check that that's first. Because that's a bang yeah, bang. Yeah, I make sure y'all check that out too, man. I did put out a mic drop, but I got that shit on. It is on the uh, YouTube channel. Yeah. Again, under Mooney Wild, L U N N I I E E W Y L D. And even on the rebroadcast, when we put this out, you know, everything will be below the YouTube links. How to get Adam, his yeah. social media information, where you can go right. get your music, he said, on all DSPs. So, all DSP. type Pandora. in his name, it'll be in the email. Mm -hmm. I mean, in the description box down below, tap yeah, in. Yeah. You yeah. use what? Spotify, Apple Music, Deezer. Uh, I don't give a damn what you did. He's dead. Hey, yeah. So TV. whatever you use, no excuses. You're going to have the proper spelling down below. Yeah, I'm right. Tap in. Yeah, I'm Become right. a fan. Yeah, yeah I'm right. Become a supporter. Yeah, support. Yeah, support a first mm -hmm. fandom next. We want people yeah. to fake know no, you want some Michael Jackson shit. No, for sure. For sure. <laughs> no, for sure. For sure. But, you know. But no, he said, I'll say it. 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 i will say it i will that's real. Yeah, so. that might as well. But y'all yeah. artists, I'm telling y'all, this is the blueprint. I don't want to interview yeah, yeah. struggle rappers, so I stop. The blueprint. Yeah. 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 The blueprint. Come on with it. Man, man that's love. Man, that's love. So what I'm, what I'm gonna do to you, what I'm gonna do to you, little one, what I'm gonna do, brothers, I'm gonna make a big ass 
situation with it. Let's do it. For so long, I can get the fucking email. I don't know. It's not in there. Let's do so, it. We need to... what I'm going to do oh, is I'm going gonna... to make you do a drop. Okay. So that when we drop this, when we get it all straightened out on the radio station, mm-hmm. I'll make you a nice ass drop. I'm going to make your drop introduce your own shit. Speaking of the radio no, streaming you, yeah. we're gonna we're gonna do a proper rollout on our end. Yeah. Okay. Um you might get your own day where we just blast your shit all day. Oh man. Well, we could do that for an hour, we could do it for two. We could do it till your music run out. Well, it's so niggas where they can come hear it in real time. Yeah, they're right. You know I hate to I hate to break the bad news to you. We got our tentacles and a lot of stuff. No, it's, so it's when I say I, you got my support, you got their support, but more so than just the radio, it's like, listen, promo. What do you want? Right. What do you need? We got that person. Okay. So we got your back. Yeah, Long right. story short. Yeah. And, it, and it's great. It's not crazy because the, it's the same as that words he said was the day before yesterday. Yeah. Before yes, talk? Yesterday. It was yesterday? Yeah, was it yesterday? Yeah. Yeah. It was yesterday? Yeah. That was that? Yeah. 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 And goddamn hey, we in this bitch today, you hear me? In another state, you hear me? We was in another state, came Fresh back, and we got back on it. Hey, you yes, hear me? He, he, he said, yeah, my man in Arizona and all that. I was at my niece's like, birthday party. How are we going to do an interview tomorrow? <laughs> yeah. right, your birthday, your daughter's birthday party. Yeah, right. I got the text message. Just morning, I woke up. We got an uh, interview today at 4 o'clock. I'm like, God yeah. damn, yeah. okay. Yeah. I Yo. bet. <laughs> yeah, right. I was working doing your birthday party. Hey, I, I, I saw you over there. I saw you working. Right, yeah. I saw you working. This most definitely was definitely was definitely was definitely. You know what's crazy? Most people do their New Year's resolutions and all this shit. Coming into the New Year, I judge a New Year from my birthday birthday. I was born in December. So every December 12th, I just sit to myself. I'm a sad. Sad. Uh, okay. Yeah. Nah, nah, nah. Okay. Nah. I, um, my daughter's a rebel. Y'all some good people. Y'all independent as hell, ironically. <laughs> I call her Miss Independent Brother on Hollywood. But y'all some independent people. Y'all got a spirit that won't allow mm-hmm. y'all to sit still and make another nigga make a move. Yeah, yeah, no, I respect that. You said you're sad? Yeah, I'm sad. Yeah, yeah, my son is sad. Okay. Yeah, cool. right. Yeah, November 24th. Mm-hmm. Every, every birthday, I reflect with myself and say, I have to raise the bar over next birthday. I'm never satisfied. I have a problem. Exactly. And, I, I um, feel like that's an, coming into my birthday. I said wrong with that. I'm gonna put my foot on the gas one push, more year, and I'm gonna see where it goes from me pushing artist perspective. Hmm. And ironically, all of the artists that work with me announced their dates back to back to hmm. back to back, and then you pop up. Yeah, February 7th. Join the bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> Let's always, go. I've always said that. Artists, artists, help me help you. I have yeah. unlimited resources. I'm in the, I can do what I want when I want. I want to help you. Look, just but I can't because you got your shit together. I, I can't. Yeah, yeah, listen. Which is less is more, so that's better. I'll put my attention to the ones that deserve my time. I, I value my time, but y'all don't because y'all send me bullshit. Mm. <laughs> hey, I mean, hey, you, you've been here for you, people. First of all, he was oh, there yeah. since the first show. <laughs> hey, 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 do they like, I did, shit, I can't speak for every, every artist, but before I even said, like, I used to uh, join a lot of um, in, uh, people, uh, individual lives that I was actually, you know, giving reviews on music. Right. Before I even said anything, I'm, I'm listening to that shit before I even said it. Like, shit, I'm, I'm listening now, I'm listening to as a, uh, uh, as a as a person that's not the artist, you feel me? Like I'm listening right. to I, I'm listening as an outsider. You feel me? Let me hear this shit. Okay, well, as soon as I get the bottom of my head, okay, we gonna send that shit though. You mm-hmm. know what I'm saying? But I have to be like that. You feel me? Even when after I record the song and I mix it, I sit back and say, okay, now I'm gonna listen as you feel me? Listen, and not the right. artist. You feel me? So, mm-hmm. and that's it's so the little things. I don't think what? people understand yeah. attention yeah. to detail. Yeah. It's like. Yeah. We, how many times 
in an artist's lifetime when they're from the ground up. Is somebody going to say, not only am I going to play your build, your music to a global audience, you're going to get paid for it. Right. You would think that if nothing else, that would make the right. artists right. make sure that they got their shit together right. and send it properly. Yeah, nah, nah, nah. I got nah, an nah, email nah, nah, from nah, nah. an artist that did not put their name, didn't address the track, and in the subject line said, fuck with us. I promise yeah. you, that's a real story. Yeah. <laughs> And, and then they talk. They thought that it was a cool thing because we got mad so much that it started happening weekly. Yeah. Well, it, well, it was the same orders or different, just different, different, different artists. artists. Yo, what, is that, is that, I'd be so frustrated and venting on here about it because like, it happens yeah, so you much. You be your signature. Like, you supposed to nah, put your name. You to the I mean, yeah. Like, like, yeah. We like, like nigga, I ain't trying to. Nah, you, if you think I'm going to listen to your shit, see your name in the intro, nigga, then you got <laughs> yeah, I didn't even do that. I don't even do that. It was, it was so cool. Go ahead. Yeah, I'm about to say, go ahead. Go you ahead. would play 60 seconds of any song we're mm-hmm. reviewing because if I can't reach you in 60, I don't need to listen to yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. Yo, you know, niggas will really play a song yes, you know, with 60 right, seconds right. of the beat. Yeah, yeah, not, a, not a not a uh, not a whole, uh, uh, not literally not, a whole not, not that instrumental. Just the beat, so you just made me like the producer oh, yeah. and told you to get the fuck out. <laughs> yes, 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 yeah, right, exactly. I put you in exactly. audacity, See, take your vocals off and keep the beat. And that's yeah. what I try, like that's why I try to avoid it too. Like, like y'all gonna hear me like, harmonizing some, you hear me, or y'all gonna hear the beat switch up in between, like man, something. Yeah, you feel me? Like you gonna, yeah, you feel me? You gonna, yeah, I'm gonna, you gonna. Talk to say something. That Let me know that you ain't fall asleep exactly. in the studio. Exactly. We've had people exactly. send stuff that ain't mixed or mastered. Yeah. They hear yeah. all the, noise in the background. In the background. And, and they would call me in trouble <laughs> right. because I would tell them how I felt. But, but believe it or not, some of the tracks right here, I feel like, oh, well, it's not fully mixed and mastered. No, nah, but as far as your tracks, it's a different I, place. You I got can't really hear the back, exactly. you know what I mean? Yeah. No, nah, he, he no, was real when he said saying. you hear dogs barking. In the like, back. I, 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 I wasn't yes. joking when I said that. I, I, I shit like, like, like shit like that, I would probably try to make that shit an ad <laughs> Like, like something like on the right yes. fucking part. Yeah. Like, but that nigga one time on the goddamn dog. <laughs> you know that nigga hadn't even rap chat. <laughs> you know, that nigga told the goddamn song. Well, brother called in because we stopped his track because of that. And they called yeah. and was like, man, what do y'all, yeah. y'all can't do all this boo? He was like, you and after I gave him GPS right, instructions right. away, if, if you this go is your dick. best, we will tell you now. Yeah, you need to go get a day job. Yes, they hire him, bro. You, right. UPS is hiring. That's why we call it. Yeah, UPS, 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 UPS is hiring. Real fam. Click on the link. Hip hop is rap. Being an artist ain't for everybody to begin with. Being an artist ain't for everybody. Because you said it's important. You said it's not trying to derive it. You approach it like this is your way. Exactly. Exactly. It's an investment. Exactly. It's an investment. You got to put money into your craft. But if you expect everybody else to do it, then you gonna fail there. Matter of fact, this is another rapper off because he called and talked about us. Talked about his mixtape. But he was smoking at the same time. We said, "How much you spend for your blunt?" He said, twenty dollars." We said, "So you couldn't spend ten to go?" No, 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 no. Wait, wait. It makes sense. He spent twenty dollars for his weed, so he's smoking trash. <laughs> he's smoking trash. Then <laughs> he made trash music. Hey, listen, man. <laughs> I'm not saying. I'm just saying. Hey, man. Y'all was... about to start some shit over here. <laughs> this ain't even UPS Harris right now. I remember his name. If you like me, look at him out. I was just saying this too. Like, I wanted to start a podcast where, like, you feel me? Like, y'all gonna hear the real. Like, y'all can't expect for because the people must be around is just a yes man, motherfuckers. Yeah. Nah, it's funny you say that, that because man. that's what I used to tell them. I'm not your friend, I'm the no man. man straight up, don't I'm the don't, one to don't. tell you. Go get a job. Hey, matter of fact, I got the app. We had the applications on desk. We will yeah. send you a link. We'll yeah. send you an yeah. email scan of the application. Fuck <laughs> no. <laughs> That's not crazy. Listen, we sent the link a couple Yo, times. Yo, listen, go go we all go to Walmart for something. There ain't enough cashiers at every Walmart. Yes. Them niggas need positions. Come on. Man, bro. Y'all niggas need to go get a job. Rap ain't for you. Because I got, I got, I got, bro, I ain't gonna lie, like, like my right hand, like my little, my, my little brother, you feel me? Or Smoke, man, shout out Smoke. This ass, this ass, bro, in the studio with me every time I make something, you feel me? He'll let me know if that shit garbage or it's trash, man, you feel me? As soon and as he said that shit, you appreciate him so much. Yeah, right. As soon as he said that shit, I go hard. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. That's what you're supposed to do. Yeah, all right. You know, that man right. cares about you because yeah, he's right. not going to let you make a fool of yourself. Exactly. Or if he think it's somewhere where it could go to the next level. It exactly. may not be criticism. It's like, yo, if you say it like this, I hear this as the listener. You might want to 
I can live with people like that. No, they gonna be your shit. best people. I can most definitely say shit since um since he actually been because I drag his ass like shit. We be uh, uh, this is the first interview that his ass not here with me. You feel me? With shit like every session, you feel me? He'll let me know like you feel me? Like he see a superstar in me. You feel me? Like brother, like. I see, like, I see the superstar in you, feel me? Like, he, he pours shit, like, he actually sees that shit, you feel me? And Smoke is a nigga where he ain't gonna, he ain't gonna capture you at all. That nigga, he gonna keep it being with you, you know what I mean? Because he more on the, like, he, I, I just got him to learn how to do a little melody and shit like this, switch his swag up because yeah. he, he sold one of them high speed uh, artists as well back at home and shit. So, you know what I'm saying? But, you know, People that know music gonna, gonna get that shit playing with you. I mean, they gonna let that shit be known. They ain't gonna hit exactly what buddy said. He ain't gonna, he ain't gonna want nobody to make a fool out of this. No, no, no. And that's a good thing that you got your brother. And that's somebody that's close to you is gonna tell you, hey, man, that, that ain't that ain't it. You know right. Well, that's the one right there. Just right. do this to him real quick. You yeah. know what I'm saying? I want my brothers to do that shit, man. Shit, especially Marco ass. I'm like, nigga, you, nigga, I sent him some shit that's like, the same of what I just sent. And he be like, ah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, nah, now nah, we talk. I'm like, nigga, that's the same shit. <laughs> 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 like, what the fuck? I ain't gonna do this. Hey, man. Hey, <laughs> but nah, they, they most definitely, you feel me? I love that shit because, you know what I'm saying? They, they push me, you feel me? Yeah. And I don't write shit down, bro. I'll be in the crib just punching in. You feel me? Like, I'll probably smoke and just punch in, you feel me? And make the whole song like that, you know what I'm saying? Dude, that's one of the best ways. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's one of the best ways, man. Come on, flowing like a motherfucker. Yeah. Especially when you, when you can do both. You you can sing and you can and you rap and you mm -hmm. write and all that. I mean, well, not really rap, but you just you format this shit in your head. You yeah, put this right. shit out. You know what I'm saying? That's the best fucking way, especially yeah, when right. it's that puts you on the whole cat yeah. by yourself. Exactly. exactly. Yeah, right. Because you get the melody, so you are. If, if you can sing the melody, okay, well, then shit. Let me put some. Let me put this little ad lib in it. Yeah. Okay, then that shit go pop. Yeah. Okay, then let me just go to the next stage and we go. You know what I'm saying? That's All what right. it is. You know what I'm saying? Like, right. bro, I've been doing this studio shit and, and singing shit for a long motherfucking time. You know what I'm saying? So even yeah, when yeah. I do get in this motherfucking thing, I feel like I'm a veteran every motherfucking time. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Shit, man, you know what I'm saying? Shit, and there's a lot of motherfuckers that, that come in here and they don't have that shit to go. If you don't know what your song's supposed to sound, how how it is supposed to know what they're supposed to sound? Exactly, exactly. And, you that's, know what and that's another reason why. Um, I, that's another reason why a lot of engineers can't can't record. Yep. Is that's another reason why? Because I I didn't got so used to recording myself and knowing how I sound. Now it's only a selected few that actually know that I can sit and work with because you feel me like they understand. You feel me? Some engineers where I ain't got say shit, and they own it. You feel right. me? Right. But then you got some engineers where when you come to their establishment, right, they expect for you, they only respect for you to know how to engineer. You know, mm -hmm. they expect for you just yep. be the artist. Yep. Until you get to, hey, like, yeah, now put this compressor right shit up your hair, now move up yeah. ass attack real quick. They're going to be like, well, like, shit, we want to sit down? Shit, fuck it. Back there, they're going to get half off. <laughs> <laughs> right? Like, shit. You know I mean? like, I think I'm paying you, you for this shit, man. You feel me? So, yeah, yeah, so, for real, you feel me? So, take a couple of thousand off that thing. Right, right, you feel me? And then so, you can move out my way. Yeah, right. right. You know what I mean? But shit, you got some people that just don't like how to get told their job and shit. But shit, man, I ain't leaving the studio. I don't like my shit. Yeah, real shit. You feel me? Real shit. And I learned that from a high-end artist. Wayne. Wayne said that, you feel me? I don't know if I said that, but I don't know. Sit down. I'm going like that. You yeah, feel yeah, me? Yeah. No, Wayne always said, never leave the studio without, you feel me, feeling satisfied mm -hmm. with your work. You know what I'm saying? Never feel never feel like that you just have to be okay with what's presented with you. You got to make sure that you like it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Ever since then, shit, I ain't leave the studio shit without being satisfied. That's what you're saying. to be. Right. That's how it's supposed to be, brother. Oh, yeah, man. Oh, yeah, but with these beats, too, man. Shout out my boy Mello Beats, man. He, he going crazy. OTT Dion, man. You know what I'm saying? They, um, most of their beats is on uh, the beats that y'all guys most definitely heard. You feel right. me? So, yeah, they most definitely, most definitely doing their shit with that. You feel me? They tap there. For sure, for sure, for sure. Yeah, yeah right. Nigga, do your shout, do all your shouts out, man. Uh, yeah, yeah, who shit. you want to give love to? Give me you the flow. Man, shout out this. This is MT, man. You feel me? 
first and foremost, thank you for having me, man. Shout out Melo, D, shout out OTT Dion, man. Shout out my family, shout out Wolf Yang, man. Shout out to the shout out St. Louis. Shout out, man, Vegas, you here, man. Cause I'm coming. Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't even know yet, man. But shout out everybody that support me, man. Shout out everybody that push me, you feel me? Damn, man. Shout out God. You feel me? Shit. Man, it wasn't him. Man, it wasn't him. I wasn't even being this much, man. man. For sure. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? I'm really going to continue to live these blessings. Yes, live sir. these blessings, man. Continue to do our damn thing with it. You feel me? Yes, sir. Y'all make sure y'all stay tuned thin. You feel me? Don't sleep on yourselves, bro. We got two singles coming out February 7th, February 13th. Minister Society in, in Too Deep. It is. Yeah, I heard it first. It did yes, say it's an empty. And we finna run it up. So just know, y'all finna hear this all through the playlist. That's right. Y'all, this is not gonna be the last time that you heard this, man. You not gonna be. This not gonna be the last time you sing this, man. Sure won't. We, we'll, we'll be back. We like him. We'll be back. No, he's not gonna be back. You, to be back, that means you have to leave. He ain't gonna. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, this, you will see him again. Yeah, yeah, he's in the fan. He does. I know he got his own crew. He front of Lou. He got a team, he had mm-hmm. all that, but he got extra reinforcements. Now he dancing for right. sure. Yeah, yeah. That's what we do. <laughs> Let's rock yes, out. Yes, sir. We locked in, baby. Yes, sir. I can't be gassing and run with nothing right. less than great right. ones. He had great ones. Hey, man, I appreciate it. That's what it is. I appreciate right. it, man. I appreciate it, man. All right. Let's get to you up in this business. Yes, yes, sir. <laughs> all right. So we finna get back to our normal schedule over mm-hmm. here. We're gonna let y'all people go, but just you know, know, before we go, a little bit of housekeeping. Go right ahead, sir. We're on YouTube with it. Mm-hmm. Please and thank you in advance. I'm giving my please and thank yous. Please. It's free. Bye. Take a second. Subscribe. Stop what you're For doing. Sure. Hit the like button. Subscribe. Even more importantly, share it with your friends. Mm-hmm. Tell a friend to tell a friend. You know what? Lock in. Looney Wow. I also yes, saw what was another pseudonym you had. Lou Wop? Am yeah. I wrong with that? All right, yeah. I'm not crazy. Yeah. I do a little you bit of lot, that I am. You got Lou Wop, you feel me? Lou, yeah, Lou Wop, you got Tom, you got Lou. Yes, that's it, because yeah. I say that because you may be internationally known as well, which I'm sure you are. You get around, people might know you by different things and put it together like, yeah, he told me my man. So I yeah, want you to, you know, yeah, let people know what you call. Yeah, right. Yeah. Rico, Lou Wop, Looney, Tom. Yeah. Him, Prussian. He's <laughs> him. So his 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 whole everything is gonna be in the description box. A lot of yeah, it right. will be edited. It's gonna be on the screen. So there's no excuse that you can't find where to tap in. Let me take that back. For the remedials, I may put it in a closed caption and turn up that sound for the hard of hearing, not being funny. Mm-hmm. Um, we want everybody to know what's going down. And we don't want to exclude nobody. You're going to tap in. If you tap in with us, you're going to be tapped in with them. That's you know what? what it is. That's what we do. You know what? You know what? Because all my life I had to get up and go get it. I was hungry. Wasn't worried about the bitches. My mind frame on the money. Mm-hmm. Buck sales at that pot of 250. I be in your corner. What yeah. you need? I supply. If you plot me, then take it from me. I can't take a loss. So my little son, he going to be a boss. If a nigga try me, your best family going to take a loss. Trail in my tattered tears. I put my love in the king. Blood leaking from my veins, bitch, because I ain't never changed. I just want it all. Penny, nickel, down. I keep the change. Been a solid nigga. You been trailing. I'm a bust your brain. Never in my heart that I had thought that you would tap my name. Guess the love real, but you know people switch. They really change. Right. God damn it, I like the way you fire. Fire. <laughs> <laughs> fire. Yeah. What I would have to ask. Yeah. See, this is this is <laughs> dead serious. Dead serious. Anybody wants one that a hundred thousand? Listen, y'all heard the man. Y'all heard the man. I'm letting the dogs loose for the rest of 2024. Hey. Get your bars up. Get your music up. Then get your right. promotion up. Y'all gotta do something because. <laughs> if it ain't that serious, that ain't it. I promise. Hey man, I got so much shit, bro. And speaking of beats too, man, I need a beat, bro. I, I, I had wrote someone when I was in this line and shit. Like, Tell me what you it's want. Called, it's called Brotherly Love. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna give it to y'all. You heard? You know what I'm saying? I didn't go like, look. 
Look, you keep it real with me. I keep it real with you. Just bradley love, nigga, and I know what we've been through. I never must let a bitch come between the me and you. So I advise you to keep it gangster with me, like I do with you. You keep it real with me. I keep it real with you. Just bradley love, nigga, and I know what we've been through. I never once let a bitch come between the me and you. So I advise you to keep it gangster with me, like I do with you. We riding around in the Caprice, nigga. We barely sober. I'm sipping on Remy Martin. You mix it with Coca Cola. I know the struggle that we've been through. Too hard to come over. Fist fighting with different niggas from different blocks is over. Now, if you know that, then you gonna see me cut up. So think about what you about to do before you get fucked up. I'm standing all 10 for my brother. So nigga, what up? Come for Rico. You gonna die really standing. That's on my mother. Look, my blood drip from my flesh. Every time I lose a soldier, I wish I can be with him daily so I can cherish the moments. I don't know the money, bro. Ain't no time to go back home. I'm trying to see different faces on dollar bills until I'm gone. And if you're with me, then let's roll. Fuck you waiting for. Love can get you killed, but your Lord it really means the most. I know it's hard out there, but nigga, you gotta keep your hope to keep your head up high and talk to God when you be feeling low. You keep it real with me. I keep it real with you. Just battle it live, nigga, and I know what we've been doing. I never once let a bitch come between the me and you, so I advise you to keep it gangster with me like I do with you. You keep it real with me. I keep it real with you. Just body lead live, nigga, and I know what we've been through. I never once let a bitch come between the me and you, so I advise you to keep it gangster with me like I do with you. Mm. Oh, what do I say? Chill, bitch, my butter coming. Let me ask some hold on. I love it. What you going on? You don't going on? I'm not shit chilling with this bra, smoking on square, thinking about the next dollar that I'm going to touch by tomorrow. Okay, I'm posting side so we can toss some business. All right, bro, I love you. I'll be there soon. Just give me five minutes. It's just like I was about to say, that that light work? That's just like shit, man. This is Dan Serious Radio. Listen, download the app. Then you ask the, for Man, dead, the word dead, yeah, second right. word serious, S E R I U S. Because remember, if you don't get mad, don't get mad, get serious. You a heavy woman, I ain't understanding. So I'm spending the bars of pain. He said he wrote that in a slam. Come on, man. Like, man, you said you was a singer, right? Oh, yeah. All right, so I got this shit work. I wrote this in two hours and did it right. It was a. Now, this one I was thought. Fucking with the sound, and uh, this actually kind of sound like a uh, what's that gentleman name? Man, uh, mm-hmm, 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 mm-hmm. Bruno Mars, like a Bruno Mars type of sound. Yeah, Greg, like, look, like on the toxic relationships and shit. This is just the hook. I ain't got shit else, so we can do something. Let's do it. You know, don't go back where you came from. I don't want you no more in my life. Hey, hey. I did what I could do, now it's time for me to say goodbye. Hey, hey. All I wanted was a life for us, and all you wanted was to fight and bust, but I can see now. All I wanted was a life for us, and all you wanted was to fight and bust, but I can see now. Go back where you came from, I don't want you no more in my life. Hey, hey. I did everything I could. Now it's time for me to say goodbye. Oh, my mom, we're going to put that shit to work. That's going to be the next single. You hear me? Yo, where you came from? How many of your artists could be in the interview? <laughs> Just start <laughs> creating in the studio <laughs> or, the, <laughs> or the park. <laughs> Stop playing <laughs> with us. This is Dan Sears. Bring your motherfucker. We don't follow rules over here. Damn. That was we not scripted. We didn't know he was going to do that, but he we cooked up on air, man. We on air right now. Live. Live. Man. Live. Man. For real, man. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Yeah, we're going to do some work. Yeah, work begins. It's time, man. I'm excited. I'm ready. I'm ready. You're a friend of the family. Pull up. You got a new single you want to put out there? Listen, it's a call. Right. I really want to. Man, I just did something last night. Man, I was in the studio last night too. So I got I got so cooked up. Man, my my brother, man, my big cousin, LRTK, man. He doing his thing out there in Arizona, made some shit. We got some shit going crazy called Rob the Rops. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, all right. Oh, wow, wow. That wolf all the right. Just a whole lot of loose shit going on yeah, around right. these parts. Man. You feel me? Last minute, see? Oh, that was shit. I want to bet it. Like that. I'm going to get it as soon as I drive <laughs> because that wolf all the right. Let's make, let's make it clear once like, again. Oh, yeah. This is the introduction. He's not yeah. going nowhere, so he's coming back. I, yeah. As a matter of fact, I'm gonna be around February seventh still. I was damn right. So I listen, we can name you the single, get you more promotion on the day of drop. Make it do it. Let's go. Let's oh, do man. it, man. Yeah, I'm gonna get in the work, man. I'm gonna get in live tonight. Fuck it, man. Okay.
Then I shoot y'all some more tonight. All right, man. man. Man, you already know you got the green light. Let's go. Yeah, all right, man. Shit, man, bro, it's a pleasure. Y'all don't even know, bro. Like, I'm on y'all ass, bro. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, man. Bro, like, I <laughs> like, pause. You hear me? Like, bro, like, bro, don't come for everything. That's mine, bro. Like, I didn't sit that back and true. humble it and 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 let everybody do their shit and have not seen. Enough. Now well, I gotta show y'all. We don't do humble over done. here. You a humble guy, yeah, but we I not humble because we believe in what you got going on, Appreciate and we gonna make people see our vision. And right. more than likely, they'll see things our way. I hear yeah, most of them. They gonna no tap choice. in and do what they you do. No choice. That's no, no choice. That's the whole thing. We put pressure. No, no choice. Well, I'm sorry. I'm applying pressure. You real? I'm applying pressure. Y'all gonna hear me? Well, like I said in the description box. The app link, his music link, his YouTube link, how you can tap in on social media. Man. And don't be scared to talk to him. Talk, reach out, let him know what you like. And like he said, if you don't like something, he take the criticism and he cares about his heart. Yeah, so tap it, just salute. Yeah, all right. Yeah, all right, man. And we can work. We yes, can work. Listen, yeah, you got yeah. beats. You got beats. You, you got a song you song. think you might fit on. I even you might fit on something. Talk yeah, to him. Right. Right. The conversation. Yeah. All right, when y'all go tune into the music, y'all gonna see the different personalities straight up. Yeah, yeah. straight That's up. It. And um, like over the head. Yeah, so tell them one more time where they can find you, website, um, man, your social media, man. spell it out for them. Because go, on we got Google, go on Google and type in L U N N I I E E W Y L B. Again, the fact L- that he's telling L- you to Google him, he's just stunning on y'all bitch ass yeah. rappers. Because <laughs> a lot of y'all Google struggle me, rappers man. don't even have a website, don't have <laughs> properly titled me. We told you, man, he's tapped in Google. Man, man, Google me. You hear me? L U, two N's, two I's, two E's, W Y L B. The first Shit article like that's that. going to pop up is MTV USA back in 2021. I don't have anything else to say. He just, what he did was he humbly bragged on y'all niggas. Y'all don't got them. MTV links. None of y'all. Respectfully. Respectfully. Y'all don't even got links to your music. <laughs> <laughs> no. Y'all got me back on this record. And y'all know what I do here. Hey, respectfully. I, I solemnly swear I'm up to no good on this motherfucker. <laughs> I promise y'all. He's as I I'm, 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 I'm up so to no tired good. for too long. Struggle rappers is dead in 2024. Y'all get nothing. Man. Y'all get another year of pure struggle where you're not going to make it. <laughs> If you want me to listen to your music, send it to I'm never gonna listen at gmail.com. <laughs> yes, that's a real website, and I give artists sentiment there. Hey, hey, bro. I re- <laughs> I'm never gonna listen at gmail.com. Hey, bro. send it. I ain't gonna lie, that means y'all gotta y'all gotta come with some shit for him to listen. Oh yeah. Like I'm tired. I'm tired. Like soon as that soon I'm as that still in the color purple tie to y'all niggas. <laughs> I'm more tired of y'all than she was a Mr. After <laughs> one year. Hey, so that, that motherfucker come on. 0.01 <laughs> seconds. You better say some hard, nigga. Like, you better come with some shit. And don't you dare email deadseriousentertainment at gmail.com. <laughs> Talking some fuck with us. Fuck with who? No, fuck you. I fuck <laughs> No, I'm t- yo, I'm tired of this. Put it in that work, man. I ain't gonna lie, man. This shit oh, don't yeah. come easy. Y'all gonna see, man. Y'all gonna appreciate this shit once you start seeing the shit that you do for yourself. Once you start, when you start googling yourself and seeing the work that you put in, bro, this shit gonna, it's gonna, it's gonna bring you more and it's gonna, it's gonna, it's gonna appreciate it way more. You feel me? Yeah. You gonna appreciate it way more. You feel me? I feel like this, even though I was doing shows and actually, you feel me? Um, putting music up. Just because I couldn't Google myself, I said I ain't, I ain't, I, ain't, I wouldn't shit. I wouldn't wow. doing nothing. I said because if my, my name ain't can't be on Google, if I can't put in enough work, that was my that was my thing. I put in enough work to get my shit on Google. And so as I seen my name on Google the first day that I typed that bitch in, I said, Oh bitch, we go. I'm I'm Mr. Disrespectful, but he giving y'all some real jewels. And that's real, real. for the artist that's taking in the jewels yeah. and really want to apply it. He's telling you the right thing. Get up off your ass. Tupac said it. Get up off your Not ass right. if you're trying to be rich. Nah, real real. Shit. How do you think people are gonna listen to your music? This, this this computer shit is cool. It connects yeah, you with people cool. all over. Yeah. But if you're not out there shaking hands and putting it out to yeah, the world working. and they can see you and feel the vibe, yeah, they'll listen to your music and never come back. You don't right. want that. 
Definitely. Restaurants make food to make you come back because it's good. He do that with music. It's the same thing. Don't mm -hmm. cut corners trying to take the fast route, looking at numbers, exactly. thinking you're doing something. Exactly. It's the yeah. genuine connection with your music to the fans. Yeah, yeah. But I don't know nothing. I just got 30 years of experience in the field you're trying to break in, but I'll stop. I'll stop. <laughs> I don't talk your shit. You don't stand there. Talk your shit. I No, I, I got to chill. Because I, 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 I get mad. You Stay tuned. I feel like we've been. <laughs> right? Yeah, it's like we've been. I get I mad know, because bro. I put a lot of hard work in and I love mm -hmm. music. I really do. I love the integrity of music, yeah. more importantly. So the same vitriol that I give artists for doing bad, when we have a good one. I'm here to show you all the differences. Look in the mirror, humble yourself, mm -hmm. and understand you're not on this man level at the basic level. Hey, this I nigga's bigger it, and man. better than more sign artists because he's not lazy. Yeah. He don't have a super machine. That's, that's, that's he's doing love. the work, and that shit sure. matters. You can't skip steps. There's no steps to skip. You can only get to where you're going by one step at a time. And he's polished. He got his shit together. He got me talking about him, so y'all know. <laughs> y'all know what I do. I want to hate That's niggas love. on purpose. Yeah. I can't hate them. niggas on purpose, baby. I hate hey. them niggas on purpose. I love you. Shit, nigga. Uh, <laughs> I appreciate it. Salute this, to Nori and Drink Champs. He always right. say, you got to get people their flowers while they can still smell them. So yes, sir. Yes, when you go yes, through enough sir. bullshit and you get something that does what it's supposed to do, it kind of hit different. You know it what I'm does. saying? So... Now, it's right. an appreciation for your craft that I see, which tells me he's not going to waste my time. He believes in himself, so I'm going to believe. I told him. He believes in himself. He's going to rock with it because I don't listen to no new age rap. Right? No, he another nigga that I'm like, that's my brother. He don't like niggas on purpose too. Hey, man. I'm going to. I'm going to. See, now, now y'all got me intrigued to the point where I want to play some shit where y'all be like, get the fuck out of here. <laughs> like, I, like, I, like real shit. Like, how many tracks can I go through? Because I, I want to see. You feel me? Y'all played that through that storm yet? Through the storm. You got see he now all I can get all I'm able to get to. I didn't get those other other emails. So, did you, you check, check the spam folder? Most definitely. Yeah, I did. I, I checked all that. Most definitely. Do, do that. Yeah, he sent it to the giant. Yeah, that through the storm. I ain't gonna cap right. Like, uh, no, in my thoughts, you got because I'm talking some shit on that. I ain't got no hook on that, so you got. Mm. Yeah, I ain't got no hook on that, so you got to hear. It, you hear it? <laughs> and you know what, thoughts, too? That's how we gonna close the show with that song because you're passionate thoughts. about that. Man, no real shit. In my thoughts, man, I feel like everything I'm speaking, but people didn't thought about that shit. You hear me? We gonna live for today, and not for tomorrow, but we are gonna let today be more successful than it was yesterday. Okay. That part. Talk you know, that right. talk one more time because right, I man. think that went over some phrase. of these chicks' lace fronts. Man, I, bro, I made that shit. I made that what? quote myself. I just said, <laughs> we going to live for today and not for tomorrow, but we going to let today be more successful than it was yesterday. That's a gem, y'all. That's a gem. Real shit. Real shit. Matter of fact, we can, we can, we can, we can fuck it. Let's play it on the phone. It's out there. Yeah, you good. Yeah, yeah. My shit, Dad, but you got yours. Hey, man. It was a fucking blessing. Yes, sir. We're going to close it out, but we're going to put the song at the end of the video, so stay tuned. It's coming right on after we in the broadcast. Because yeah. the they got to hear that. In my thoughts. In my thoughts. In my thoughts. He say, he say, I got that talk about it too. It's a loony of fish, referee original, hand me my whistle. If you ain't making money, your life gonna be difficult. Serving out the trap, my house be booming. I ain't talking Metro. Home. <laughs> Listen, I'm from the boogie. I love ball. Yeah, so right. and you when I hear a nigga talk on record, I don't care about slang, accent. You're talking, you're talking. Yeah, right. That's a universal language no matter where a person from. I put this in that too. I say 
I could rock a party from New York to Santa Fe, California. Latina Cuban bitches looking amazing. They all farmers. <laughs> come on now. Hey, man. I got to listen to that and talk about it. That's on the tape, too. That's on the um, All in One mixtape. Y'all make sure y'all go check that out. You know oh, saying? they're getting a link to that. Oh, yeah, they're getting your listen. Yeah, I took right. down That's in that, that description box. If you if you like what you heard from them, you want to know more about them, you still mm -hmm, need right. more proof. Everywhere you could tap in with them, going to be there. So it's no excuse to not tap in. Let's stay tapped. Just click the link. Go listen to this man's music. Tap in. Pour a drink. Roll up if that's what you do. Or meditate first. Whatever right. y'all do, but just listen to it. Give them a chance. Yeah, right. I got that slow jam music for y'all women, too. It's called Don't Move. Remember, he said your artist. He got music for the ladies specifically, yeah, too. Right. Let's go. Yeah, ladies, right. tap in. Tap in. He Check fresh to death. He got gallery department. He stayed yeah, well man. groomed. Stop playing with him. You feel me? As I try. You did. Press the person, be the best person. You mm. All the time. Yeah, Lead with your best foot. I, I try to help people. Yeah, I'm right. We must definitely be up. But, you, you know, this is the too. time period. We're not telling niggas no more. We want to show them and be nah, the example it. we want them to see. Yeah. We've been through that. Watch this. We've been through that. They don't want that. Watch this. Watch this. I gotta be ready. Who's still tuned thing, man? But say I know you gonna make it. I see it. You ain't in the gym. I'm down in the rough. You're getting sharp and I'm all getting to your prayer. I believe in you, my brother. I know you're gonna make it through the battle career. That's him. I got you. That's him, y'all. Yeah. I'm on his live and I'm in. telling y'all to. Great one said he's a great one. I promise you. Blessings. I do not throw that title around to artists. When I label somebody a great one, Man. they're a great one. He's him. Man, I, I ain't gonna lie. Like it means it means a lot to me, you because from uh, us being from different, you know, age. You, 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 you feel me? You feel me? And then it's like a lot of because a lot of a lot of individuals, you know, what I'm saying around like, they just really just don't listen to young or this music like that. Well, I'm gonna tell you what it is. Most of them are stuck in an era that's never coming back, and they're mm. sad. They, they, it's attached to their childhood. It's, it's nostalgia. Mm. They only remember what made them feel good. Mm. They out of touch. Not all to old music ain't good, and all new music ain't bad. Well, so well, stop that ageism and all that generational gap. Generational gap is doesn't exist. Mm. Wu Tang and Nas and them niggas is still mm. going on the tour in their fifties. In their fifties. Yeah. These young niggas right. that are mainstream can't get 5,000 niggas to buy a ticket right, right. So exactly. Oh. old niggas stop hating and young niggas embrace the OGs. Some of these niggas know that. what they talking about. I'm glad they you can spoke help. on that because uh, I will be uh, I will be performing with the Dog Pound, Sigo de Mayo, Phoenix, oh. May. Oh, uh, did, did he just drop? Uh, <laughs> he drop Let's rock right out, there? man. Like, Yo, uh, he's the most man. humble nigga in America. Hey, struggle rappers. Nice. How many of y'all performing on the West Coast with a legendary group called the Dog Pound? Man, man. None of y'all. Um, Send it to I'm never going to listen at gmail.com. I want to live my brother C Knight from the Dove Shack. I was saying that a big mess records. Wow. So, I want to live C Knight from the Dove Shack. I want to live badass because I met badass when I performed in Holly High School. You dig what I'm saying? I was wow. 19 at, at, at that time. So, yeah, but I will be performing with the Dog Pound opening up. Single to Mayo, Mayo well, May, oh, and Phoenix. And he's gonna be in Phoenix, baby, tickets, Mexico, baby. so it's gonna be lit. Yeah, right. Yeah. And we got a ticket, we got a ticket link. You feel me? So hit me for the link. You know what I'm saying? Everything on will most definitely be out there. You know what I'm saying? Make sure y'all get that. Yeah, I'm gonna hit this mic up, man. Yeah, I'm gonna yeah, hit this mic up. Yeah, man. Yes, sir. I, I tried to tell you, we wasn't you know, playing man. around this year. Like, for real? We never play around, but this year. We operated without applying pressure because it's just it come mm. with it. We can't do nothing about yeah, it with right. those guys, but we want to apply a little bit of pressure. We're gonna make yeah, it uncomfortable right. for radio. A lot of, well, a lot of off. What's crazy is man, I'm gonna drop a gym, bro. Like I ain't never been this humble in my life. That's how I know God got something in store for me. I ain't never been this humble in my life. You heard me, but you understand I, I what's sure. in front of you too, yeah. and I can see that. Yeah. Yeah, I've been speaking it. I've been manifesting. In my thoughts. There you go. Yeah, I've been in my thoughts. You hear me? Like, I've been manifesting, you know. Mm -hmm. There God, you go. You shall, yeah, you shall ask, you shall receive. Man. All day. Straight up.
Give me today's right. uh, projection. Yes, sir. Yeah. All right, as we close this out with In My Thoughts. In My Thoughts, baby. From Looney Wild. You dig? <laughs> Dead serious radio. Don't get mad, get serious. Man, it's your boy Catch on Jay Gatsby, JR the Rockstar, Lil Lil, yeah. and Looney Wild, motherfuckers. Let's yeah. get it, baby. Yes, sir. Dead serious, baby. I'm trying to record it. Oh, Tell my voice like, we going to ever get closer when the last you gotta get focused, you gotta get motivated here. Yeah. Yeah. So I did. Even though I say I'm okay, just know that I ain't fine. They know that well they fuck low when they thought to cross that line. I can't even see me crossing one of my guys But if they do, then God forgive me for not reading between the lines For being blind I told my dog I'm trying to record a hit The ops keep blowing up my phone cause they know a nigga with I cut the snakes up out my grass, I couldn't afford to go miss it. You gotta watch the ones you keep around you, they're a part of your image Drowning in my pain and my sorrow I know too many niggas who ain't gonna be able to see tomorrow It ain't easy putting your trust in motherfuckers cause your heart cold The same niggas who watch you starve ain't gonna offer you no meat low Looking in the mirror, I've been working on self-improvement, I see change Trying to figure out how to control my anger yeah. Yeah. Let's go. When it was me and you against the city, it was us against them I beat myself up cause I couldn't make it to the Steve funeral When we all slid, I was front line Deep in my thoughts, I wanted to catch your pill, I couldn't stop crying You know that well, when the chariots get behind us, we all speed I mean, when the laws jump behind us, we turn into need for speed I'm popping Percocets on a daily, this will help me sleep It be too many thoughts roaming around my brain, I can barely think Rather talk to myself, I don't need no doctors, I don't need no shrink They say a drunk be speaking the truth, somebody hand me a drink And I can't let a nigga think he can play with me Ain't no nigga on this earth, put in no fear I wish a motherfucker would challenge me There'll be a day of messy murder scenes and tragedies Yeah, please excuse me, I'm in my thoughts, I'm slipping off topics It's just some shit that you don't do when you get up in that jam Even if they interrogating you and throwing you the book you keep quiet and take that charge and stand like a man Where I'm from, you will lose your head if they find out you told on them Had to keep my distance from them fake niggas who plotted on me They act like I don't know that they was the ones who plotted on killing me What goes around comes around, so rest in peace, Kenny yeah. Nigga try me and he died, this what you get I got a bitch who'll steal your heart and pre-organize the I'm taking out these penitentiary changes On they block, I'm limping, I'm trying to catch it hot So that little nigga can taste his candy As soon as I catch him, make a nigga bleed they gon' get the message not to fuck with me. Yeah. I didn't see so much shit. Let me traumatize, I won't say shit. But going against the grain, go fuck around and get your face lifted. It's just some shit that you don't do when you get up in that jam. Even if they interrogating you and throwing you, you keep quiet and take that charge and stand like a man. Straight up, yeah. Let me tell you something. That's. I'm listening to. Literally everything in the world. I have a, a fucking music obsession. <laughs> if I never got paid a dime, 